the only thing that 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 sends some 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 jitters in their spine and whatever I, is the fact that I mentioned Arab Spring and yesterday one minister was still talking about that despite my acquittal and discharge he thought that I shouldn't do they re and I think that they I are mean, you, the attorney general himself and I heard him speak he yes. says what business has a senior police officer a seventh officer yes. staying on a platform and talking about Arab Spring. Does he understand Arab Spring? If he doesn't, he should keep quiet. If he doesn't understand Arab Spring, he should keep quiet. But he's a lawyer. He's, he's, he's a attorney. lawyer, but being a lawyer doesn't mean that you know everything. You can be a lawyer and be an ignorant, you be an ignoramus in an area. Mm -hmm. I teach conflict. Okay. Do you understand me? I told you I teach conflict at even M field level. I teach it at Kofiana, I teach it at all level. Arab Spring or civil uprising and other things are democratic means of expressing dissent in every society. Today we, we, we uh, espouse people like uh, uh, Martin Luther King and other things. Why are we espousing them? But we knew in 2011 yes. that this is led to the removal of governments. Tunisia, for example, is clear. The other countries within the Arab regions. That, the, 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 the explicit definition yes. and appreciation you are same. talking about explicit definition yeah. that is common knowledge yes but when you look at arab spring it is like any other spontaneous demonstration by citizens to express their their dissatisfaction which in the reality and the example if it have. leads to the fact that a government decides that do you know that we can the kumi preku could have led to uh, rolling saying that okay i've resigned could it have been called arab spring that could be Preku in Ghana. I'm not sure. Could have been, could have, could have, could have led to Rollins saying, okay, I've resigned. Once the VAT has been defeated and other things have resigned. Eh. When you go to the literature, go and Google it anywhere. Be careful you don't go to Wikipedia. <laughs> I get that. Because when you go to Wikipedia, Wikipedia will give you some definition of a rebellion, a mutiny, and other things. And I prove today. Uh, prosecution in court that when they need a definition to issues they should not go to wikipedia because they came out with a wikipedia definition which i i, I drew the attention to <coughs> and they could not talk about it again so go you to mean the attorney general the, of the republic I, of I'm, I'm saying the prosecution team okay all right whoever was representing them and it's on record i can produce it's a court record and i can give you but give that you should be very strange i mean y yes so at the end of the day you come to appreciate the fact that when you go to wikipedia definition it will tell you it's a mutiny it is so so and so, but go to other definitions which are acceptable in academia. Because when you uh, quote today, you quote Wikipedia definitions in, in, in academia, in the universities, they will not take you seriously. I get it, I know that. So, because so, so. Every so, first year student of an university would know that. that that's basically. So, I'm time. saying that when you want to know the real definition of Arab Spring, don't go to Wikipedia. Go to other sources and you to tell you the real meaning of it. And you say that's what they confronted you with a Wikipedia definition yeah, of it. A Wikipedia definition and they under the myopic understanding of that term. And that is what they confront. And that's what they have held on to till today. And that's what Attorney General is still holding on to. He should go and learn. He should go and learn. Because he's not dealing with just people, he's dealing with people who have also climbed the ladder somewhere.